Really? Really? Of all the novelists, teachers, playwrights, poets, groundbreaking visual artists, and pioneers of science, you got the TV actor. <laughs> now, when I sat where you are, right, sitting right now, I had so many dreams of where I wanted to go, who I wanted to be, and what I wanted to do. Theater companies I wanted to start with classmates, movies I wanted to be in, directors I wanted to work with, stories I needed to tell. It might take a little time, I thought, but it would happen. When I sat there, excuse me, 22 years ago, <gasps> what I didn't want to think about is where I would be tomorrow. what I would have to start to do tomorrow. <laughs> After two years of job and couch surfing, I got a job in application processing <laughs> as a data enterer at a place called Professional Examination Services. And I stayed for six years. <laughs> when I was 29, I told myself the next acting job I get, no matter what it pays, I will from now on, for better or worse, be a working actor. I got a low paying theater job in a play called Imperfect Love, yeah. which led to a film called 13 Moons with the same writer, which led to other roles, which led to other roles. And I've worked as an actor ever since. I waited a long time out in the world before I gave myself permission to fail. Please, don't even bother asking. Don't bother telling the world you are ready. Show it. Do it. The world is yours. Treat everyone kindly and light up the night.